Good morning, welcome back to another weekly vlog. Today is Tuesday and I have a couple of things to go out for. I've just been working this morning, it's now nearly 11 o'clock. I'm gonna to head to the Charlotte Tilbury Press Day. Press Days, for those of you who don't know, are for journalists and bloggers and anyone who's part of the press to show them new products that are coming out, explain how they work, so that we can then communicate to you guys if we want to about any new products. I don't always go to them because there are about 10 a day and I just can't possibly keep up. I wouldn't get any work done otherwise. But I absolutely love Charlotte Tilbury products so I definitely want to go and check out her new stuff. And then whilst I'm out, I have booked in for a facial at One Old Witch, which is a hotel in Covent Garden. And I haven't had a facial for about a year, I hardly ever have them, because they're kind of a luxury treat really. But also I find that most um, salons and spas and stuff like that use brands like Decleor and Dermatology, Dermalogica, that's what I meant. <laughs> and I don't really like those kind of brands, but this one, um, the spa in One Old Witch use Oskia, which is a brand I love. And so I really want to try out an Oskia facial and see what that's like, and see how it works when a professional is using the product. So I'm really, really excited for that. That's later on this afternoon. So I'm just getting ready because my mum's going to give me a lift to the station and then I'm going to head to South West London where the Charlotte Tilbury event is. I'm at Hyde Park Corner so I'm just trying to find... It's normally... The events are normally at Charlotte Tilbury's house but I think this time it's at a restaurant so I'm just trying to find it now. I'm at the Charlotte Tilbury launch and Amelia's here. The bright lipstick and Hannah's here. She's showing me her camera and trying to convince me to buy it. I'm sticking with this one. It's good that it's got that I'm like so bad. It's got such an enabler. screen. Yeah, you are. Especially with techie stuff, you and Steph. So that is good. We're just waiting for Charlotte to come out. She's going to talk through the launch for us. The 12 days of Christmas, and every day you get a makeup. A bit of makeup magic and a bit of skincare magic all through there. Isn't that fabulous? Leaving the Charlotte Tilbury event, it was really good. We got to try lots of makeup and with Hannah we're gonna go grab some sushi because she's got a meeting at four and I've got a facial at half four, so I want gonna... to see your facial. Do you wanna try it? <laughs> no, no way. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> So nice having lunch with Hannah and I'm just in one old witch waiting because my facial's in about half an hour so I'm just doing some emails now and I'm really excited to just switch off my phone for like an hour and a half and just enjoy a facial. I'm home now so I thought I'd tell you how the facial went because it was absolutely amazing. I felt a bit guilty just before I went in because I had a bit of a work drama going on and I very nearly cancelled the facial but I thought you know what I'm sure the world will survive for an hour and 15 minutes. I literally never ever turn my phone off even when I'm in the bath so I just really needed that time and it, it was nice because while I was having it I really did switch off. I didn't like think about anything. And it's a really lovely facial. They use all Oskia products, including the candle, which kind of melts down into an oil. And you really get your money's worth because it's not just a facial, but she kind of stretches out your legs and arms. She gives you an arm scrub and a back massage and a head massage. And they steam your skin. She literally puts like a steamer. And she does a bit of extraction if you want it. You don't have to have it. I'm not normally that into it, but I found it didn't really hurt that much. And my skin just feels amazing and looks very glowy and I loved it. I then came out and the work drama started again and I feel all anxious again, but that's fine because I felt really, really lovely whilst I was in that room. So I would definitely recommend it. I had the, I think it was the glow facial. I can't remember, I'll, I'll write it what it is in the, in the description box because I told my mum that she needs to go and have that because she would absolutely love it. It's a real treat. And I think it's nice sometimes to just treat yourself to facial or a massage where you can just actually switch off for like an hour. I always forget until I have one how good they are. Anyway, I'm just doing some work now. It's like 7.30. I think I might end the vlog because I'm feeling a bit funny. I've been feeling a bit funny the past two days, a bit like, I can't really explain it, but I will vlog again some other day this week. Today is officially the most exciting day that I have had for a very, very long time. Yesterday, very last minute, I got an email from the PR at Evian, which in itself was so exciting because Evian is in like my top five brands I've ever wanted to work with. So just being able to know someone there 
is really exciting. I bloody love it, Evian. But also, they invited me to Wimbledon, and I'm the biggest tennis fan. It's my favourite sport to play, to watch, to everything, and I absolutely can't wait because Evian have like a proper suite there, and you can like sit at their special seats and drink their water and there's a lunch and I can't wait and I get to bring a plus one so me and Rich are going and we're gonna have the best day. I've just done my makeup um, I've used the Jaclyn Hill and Becca highlighter which I don't know if you can see but I'm obsessed with it it's beautiful I know it's a bit intense for a Saturday daytime but I just love it too much that I have to use it every day I must put some setting spray on there because it's very hot today I feel like my makeup's gonna melt off also I woke up at 5 a.m. this morning the pollen count is so high so I'm taking my pills with me, but I hope I'm not sneezing all over the place. I saw that Tanya and Jim went to the Evian suite earlier in the week, and someone from One Direction was there, so I feel like uh, there might be a bit of celeb spotting today, I'm not sure. I won't be vlogging them, because that's really embarrassing, but I'm going to vlog throughout the day, wherever I can, and I can't wait! I just need to straighten my hair, and then I think we're going to go. got to Wembley, the tube was packed, but we're finally here and I haven't showed Rich yet today. He looks okay. so smart, he looks so smart in his white shirt and trousers, got all dressed up for the occasion. Look. Let's go find where we need to go. I don't know if I've said, but we're going to watch the women's finals, the centre court, and Serena Williams is playing, she's one of my favourite players, so I'm really excited. I'll be cheering her on. Are you looking forward to this? Yes. I wait for them without, like, going into the... Stadium, atmosphere, so yeah. Atmosphere. And the strawberries and cream and pims, of course. For those of you who aren't from the UK, Wimbledon is like the most English thing ever. It's so funny seeing the crowd, everyone's so posh. We're in the Avian suite, this is incredible. It's all pink and there's Evian everywhere, which... And they found the droplet things. Remember I told you guys about these and I haven't been able to find them since. They've got loads here, literally they've got like a table of them here. Are you happy to be here? Wow, yeah. And there's a table tennis table with a scoreboard and you know, you guys know how competitive I am, so I'm looking forward to playing that. And there's gonna be lunch soon. I'm literally so happy right now. It's lunchtime! Okay, we're just leaving the Evian suite. We've got takeaway pims because we want to go have a wander around. <laughs> and then the match starts at 2. Oh gosh! And I've got a little Evian for if we get hopped. Um, but we had lunch, it was really nice. And what's the guy? Lee Mack, the comedian, was in there. Yeah, let's go have a little wander. to our seats because we want to see them warming up because so we're just trying to find. This is so weird. Yeah, I've never been. It's really cool. Okay, we're at our seats and they're amazing. I feel like all seats are probably good here because it's like a circle. But look, this is what we this is what we're looking at right now. Really excited for this. Really excited. Although we were kind of rooting for Garby, is that her Garby, name? Because yeah. she was out fighting. She's a great tennis player. I think she'll do really well. I really enjoyed watching it. It was a great game. Um, it's really exciting. I just love watching tennis. We're going to head back to the Evian suite because I think they're having a bit of tea. And then we've got to head home, which is sad. Right, we've got some tea things going on. We've got a scone, I call it a scone or a scone, I can never remember. Strawberries, toasted cream, little jam. Pims with a pretty straw. And Rich got a mound of strawberries. Yeah. And the scone, which he doesn't want, but I put it on his plate because I accidentally picked up the raisin one. I just want the strawberries. <laughs> I do the cream and then the jam. Unfortunately, we have to head home now, but I've grabbed a couple of these like droplet things because I love them so much. Um, they're not going to last you very long, but I don't know why they're so hard to find in shops, but I love them. Yeah. We're going to get back on the hot, stinky tube. 
We're back home and still buzzing from such a good day. I really had the best day. I'm so happy I finally went to Wimbledon and saw such a great match as well. I'm now just going to quickly kind of touch up my makeup and redo my hair and change my outfit because we have got one of my best friend's engagement parties tonight. I feel like I'm always going to engagement parties but it's just because I'm at that age. Everyone is getting married. So I'm not going to vlog for the rest of the evening but I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog and thank you very much for watching. Bye.